Hey, right, what's going on guys? Hope you're all doing good. So we're out on the canal again today. We're doing some pike fishing. We've only got an hour, so we're doing a pike fishing power hour. I went to another canal first. The road was closed. I had to do a massive diversion. Went to another canal and there was a match on. So now I'm on backup canal three. So yeah, hopefully this is decent. Like I said, we've got an hour. Hopefully we catch a pike or two, but we'll see how it goes. I've not fished here in probably two years. So I'm not sure how it's going to be, but we'll find out soon enough. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. 13 minutes past one got an hour so quarter past two let's see how long it takes to catch a fish it's got the 18 centimeter kofi perch with the spinner tail on to start with just the water looks kind of i don't know kind of black for this place it's either usually brown or clear but i don't know if you can tell but it's got like a really dark tint to it today so i try this one to start with just with the extra vibration from the tail. I feel like it'll be a good choice. Yeah, if we don't get a hit within 15 minutes, we'll change. Kind of keep moving until I come across the weed beds. I'm hoping there's going to be weed up on this stretch. Not fished here yet. Well, for a couple of years really for pike. Yeah, not sure when the weed comes up on here, but I'm hoping it's the same as the other canal. It should be up by now. Just for if I remember right, it widens, this next bit where it widens out is sort of where the weed usually grows up so that's where i'd be expecting to find some fish so i'll whiz through this bit obviously cover all the margins we're not going to fish on any of the open water really just because it's you know we don't have time <laughs> it's very time consuming covering the water thoroughly so we're just going to fish the margins any weed we find when you've only got an hour you kind of just need to focus on the areas where there's more likely going to be fish rather than anywhere Yeah, that was straight on it then. That was straight on it as soon as it landed in the water. No way. I think it's too bad either to be fair. That was so quick. Got my net. <laughs> That's literally just got to the bit where I said there might be some weed. Straight away. You want to say? No. Yeah, my net just went open, but I'll just grab him. Oh, nice Not too bad. Didn't take very long today to get. Yeah, nice taken here, yeah there is some nice ones. Looking, yeah, he is, yeah. It's not big, but it's, it's, uh, big. it's not too skinny. It's Straight locked. back. Yeah. <laughs> nice <one>. well, <laughs> just as I get to. Uh, like I say, where it just winds up here, I'm pretty sure there's weed beds. As soon as that touched down, bang, straight on it. I don't know if anyone else has this phenomenon as well, but as soon as someone's walking down the canal, I always hook a fish. It's like, oh no, really weird, but yeah, don't see a single person at all. One person comes out in the middle of nowhere and I hook a fish just as they're passing. Bizarre, but at least we've caught a fish now. And that took exactly 11 minutes. So I keep that right up, I'm out of five fish. <laughs> but that was cool as hell. It literally banged down, tightened onto it, and it was on, just straight on. Must have cast onto his head. Like, perfect. Not too bad of a fish either, probably five pound maybe, something like that. Nice little stocky jack. I give him some confidence though. Might get another one now. I'm glad I put the bait with the bit of vibration on because like I said, there's a lot of colour in this canal. That flash from the tail as well. Help it out a bit. Well, actually, this is where I caught that fish. Just walked up to where I hooked that fish and you see the grass in the water there. Pretty much cast next to that. So that guy was probably sat right in that grass there and snuck out straight on it. I will be happy to see another one. So I find a few more grass patches, but yeah, exactly where I expect them to be in the grass. Start waiting to ambush anything that comes past. Oh, I just got hit. That's another hit. Come on, baby. 
Let's mess my hook up. Oh, that was a weird hit. Look at what I did to my hook. That's so bizarre. A proper slack line been that. But I'm not sure you guys will see the reaction on the rod tip, but real big slack liner then. Just like pushed the bait a good few feet and then when I went to hooks it, it was just nothing there. Quite a bit of grass now feeling it. Oh wow, that was a real good hit. Right in the grass. Oh no. That was such a nice hit. Oh oh come on baby that was so good absolute whacked into it then that oh man if that comes back it's a miracle it was right in the grass i just saying i'm feeling this bumping through grass and then poof, absolutely friggin jumped on it that was a real good hit then not like a weird one like that one before it was you probably can see that one on the rod tip i'll see if i can slow it down for you but such a good hit we will work back over this i'm going to save some time at the end to come back on this stretch and like really fish it effectively there's a bunch of fish with it being grassy i might actually put a top water on when i come back down and just fish right over it something a bit maybe a bit noisier what the heck was that <laughs> i am so good at fishing I've got a real mystery backlash and obviously not gripping the rod very tightly. Oh, I just had a follower. Baby, why did you not take it? That's a big swirl. That was a good old, look at that freaking swirl. Holy pizzas. Come on, baby. That was a good one, that. That was a good one. The swirl that that gave then probably saw me, to be fair. It followed right to my feet. So I've got... 35 minutes left with the power hour we're nearly halfway through we've seen four different fish already holy cheeseburgers this is getting intense one more fish i'll be stoked but i'm already stoked with how many reactions we've got with this spin tail real cool that last one should have bit it then oh, oh jesus h monkeys that one bit it oh Jumped out of the water for it then. Please come back. Please come back. Let's see if this buzz bait still swims all right. And I think I might throw that on. Might work better with the grass. Noisy as hell. That's gonna annoy some pike. Hopefully it doesn't suck the grass up way too much. See if I can find a trailer for it as well. Hopefully you can. Sweet, okay. Let's get moving. I've not got long to fish. There we go. Oh no, it's off. No, it's not, it's on, it's on, it's on. I told you the buzz better get one. Try and keep tension on this. It's only got a single hook. Come on, baby. I thought that came off then because he swam right towards me. It doesn't feel too bad again, but I don't think it's massive. It feels heavy, it might just have a head of grass. Oh, it's not a bad fish though. That is not. A bad one on the buzz bait. As soon as someone's walking down the canal again, I swear down. It's crazy. Whoa. He could throw that hook very easily. <laughs> yes, we're not even where I was getting the hits as well. Oh, he's nailed that. He's got it right in. That's a mid double all day. Yes. Stoked on that, on the buzz bait. Look how he's taking it as well. Bait straight across his mouth. Get that out of him. There we go, unhooked. Probably an 80. 
five will get a quick length on him yeah he is 80 88 centimeters it's a nice fish nice fish right there let's get a quick release see you baby i was stoked on that proper stoked on that see what one we've got oh it's got nine minutes still as well you can get another one yeah, completely took the skirt off this bait that pike in the fight but should still work without it i think nine centimeter trophy bleak as a trailer it's not a massive profile but with that noise as well it's you don't need a huge huge trailer perfect size really i do like something a bit wider like the finish fillet cross sometimes but that off those so this is just fine the length is fine three minutes let's see we call it five minutes Fishing license runs out in like seven days as well. I just got a reminder of that. The best get a new one. Oh, time up as well. One hour, four fish landed, four other contacts as well. So six total different fish we had contact with in one hour. Super good. Normally I don't get that in like a full three, four hour session, so. I am stoked with how that's gone today. I'm going to keep fishing for five more minutes just to get to the end of this bit. So if we get another fish, it will be in. But obviously, it won't count towards the power hour. Well guys, that's going to do it for this video. Quick session, but two pike, four missed as well. So yeah, well happy with that. Super nice fight on this rod with that last fish as well. On the old buzz bait, super slept on bait in this country. But yeah, first fish, Kofi Perch, second one on the buzz bait. And I'd say missed four as well. So yeah, not a bad session at all. I enjoyed that. I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's going to be a pretty quick video, I think, but it was good fun. And it's nice to get out just for an hour and yeah, do a quick session like this. So yeah, make sure you give it a go one time. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video and catch you next time.